suggest? What do you suggest? Okay, so let, this is fine. Let's go, let's go. So, so we're holding someone down from being violent and hurting people, and we're bad guys for doing that. Okay, okay, you know what? Okay, don't, don't touch people. No, no, hold on. Let him go. Okay, you know what? You know what? Let go of this man! Let him go! Let him go! Let him go! Okay, no, 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 you're wrong. You're wrong. Let him, let him go. So if he hurts somebody, it's your fault. If he hurts somebody, your fault and your fault. If he hurts somebody, police are coming. Yeah. So anyway, while everybody's here, the Bible says, the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life. So when people live in sin, these are the consequences. This is the anger towards the Christian community. We got so-called people that claim to know God. Brother Durie. Brother Dure, Brother Dure, give that to someone else. So praise the Lord. This is the reality of sin in this world. People get out of control. People get violent. We got people cursing Christians. We got Christian. Hey, listen. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for for, for uh, screaming in my ear. God bless you. God bless you. What, 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 if you want me to talk to you, you're a scholar. You're a scholar without self-control. You're raging. You're an assaulting scholar. You're a scholar without self-control. What's your degree name? Public administration. You have a doctor for Okay, so a scholar that can't control herself, she's probably gonna be stripped of a public uh, policy. You don't have to control yourself. What politician controls herself, she says. You know what? One that has integrity and ethics, and that's obviously not you. Standing on my uh, court, defending themselves, and then we're the bad guys for holding someone down from being violent, using their fists, breaking our things. And then we got so-called ladies telling us that it's not even Christian to do that. No. When somebody is violent and hurting people, why are you screaming at people, lady? What? Yeah. So, look how aggressive you are. What would you like? Look, look at that. Look at that. And now you're now you're doing the same thing. Are you a Christian? Do you even know God? I'm going to jail because guess what I do? Guess what I do? What I got hold You see, this lady, you're gonna have a citizen. Son, now, look at this. I dare you to fucking citizen arrest me. I fucking dare you. So we got a crazy black lady, crazy white lady, man. And then we got another crazy white man right there. So who 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 wants to be crazy right now? You're local. You're local. You wanna fight me? A preacher? I don't wanna fight you. I don't wanna fight. Don't don't touch the man. Nobody's better. What you're doing is wrong. That's why there's such thing as a right and a wrong. How many of you think that violence is right? Put up your hands. You guys think violence is right? So we got this man thinking violence is right. He should be in, locked up. Do you think violence is right? Talk, talk to her. The same Bible I preach from. What does it say? Violence is right. Okay, so violence is right? So should I just knock you in the head? Is violence right? Is violence right? Listen, this is the funny thing is, we got people that are, that are confused. The Bible says that those who live by the sword will die by the sword. So, so listen, this is the reality of sin. People are confused. People are punching people, walking around drunk, hurting people, raping people, murdering people, but people don't think
think that's right. We got we got loudmouth women that are raging their mouths at preachers, angry, raging. The Bible says that these are the last days. This is what happened in the first century. They put Christians in pay repent. My friends, I'm telling you, this is characteristic of the devil. The devil is the father of lies. The devil is violent. The devil is raging. The devil is rude. The devil is... Listen, you know, it's funny. Everybody's watching like it's a comedy. But if, if this was a homosexual, everybody would be raging. But I'm going to tell you what this is. This, these are, I, don't, I don't know how many other... That God so loved the world, despite the insanity, despite the craziness, despite the violence, despite the drunkenness, despite the lewdness, God still loves you. Can you, can you believe that? So do, do, do you understand that Jesus died for people like that? If this was about you, Choose Christ. Accept Him right now. You can be saved. Is there anybody here that I'm preaching to that says, you know what? I saw enough. I saw that sin, you know what? Sin is going to be filled with drunkards. Sin is going to be filled with the sexually immoral. Sin is going to be filled with murderers and thieves and idolaters. Hell is going to be filled with this place. These kind of people.